Hello everybody, it's Techno here. Today I'm going to show you the easiest way of finding Turtonator in Pokemon Sword. Turtonator is a sword exclusive, which sadly means you cannot find it in Pokemon Shield. We're going to start off today by flying over to Hammerlock Hills in the wild area. You're going to need the Weather in the Lake of Outrage to be hot, uh, sorry, Harsh Sun. So to do that, we're going to go to our Switch System settings and change the date to August 25, 2020. Go back to Sword once you've done that, and again, we're flying to Hammerlock Hills. With the city of Hammerlock behind us, hop on your bike and make a right. We're going to make our way to the Lake of Outrage, which is a small island in the northwestern corner of the wild area. It's one of those very difficult Pokemon to find there. So we're going to make our way down, and once you see this giant boulder, you can make a right. Soon after that, you'll see the Lake of Outrage itself. And using your water bike, you should be able to traverse the water and make your way across to the other side. So, uh, Turtonator, like I said, is a very difficult Pokemon to find here. There's several Pokemon that are very difficult to find in the Lake of Outrage. Once we see that harsh sun weather kick in, we want to make our way over here to this back corner. This is the easiest way of doing it, I'm telling you out of experience. So, so you want to find two Pokemon that don't chase you. Ninetales is a perfect example. Golurk is also another one, and so is Ditto. Anything that does chase you is going to be very annoying to deal with. You need to find Pokemon that spawn out of those exclamation marks, just like that. And eventually, you should be able to find Turtonator in that wild spot. Now, Turtonator spawns at a 2% chance. 2. I'm not kidding. It's going to take you a while. It took me maybe 20 minutes for Turtonator, but for the other Pokemon in these guides, it took me 40 minutes and 30 minutes and stuff like that. So it will take you a while. That's why you don't want Pokemon that chase you, because it's just going to ruin the whole flow of events. So that's the easiest way of finding the Blast Turtle Pokemon in Pokemon Sword. I hope you enjoyed the video, and as always, guys, Techno's out.